All this fuss, and we're back to square one. Are you lot are a buzzkill. The Legion is attacking the square. That's solid evidence of subversion. The city council has cleared your extermination. Your riot is over. Zoya, raise your hands. Raise your hands and surrender yourself. Do you hear me? Shoot me already or shut up. Don't give me this threatening crap. You haven't set foot in Syndicate for years. Why have you chosen to come back here today of all days? Right when the Legion is about to eradicate all other gangs and take over Syndicate. Because you'll lose your source of income once the gangs are eradicated? Or because the Legion has come upon some secret that will choke off your career? Let's return to the negotiation table, Burns. Director of the City Council, former chief of the local security precinct. This isn't a threat. There hasn't been a negotiation. This is an order. Turn over the inheritance and the sinner. Or you and your legion will perish today. Your deaths will restore the authority of the West District Order Management Regulations and serve as a reminder to all syndicates of what awaits those who rebel. Well, well. You're like a mad dog that has got its tail stepped on and can do nothing but bark. If you're so concerned about getting caught, you shouldn't have hooked up with those mania peddlers and allowed them to ruin Syndicate. What did that sinner tell you? The kid didn't discover it. I guessed it. She didn't realize that the source of a piece of information is as important as the information itself. This subordinate of mine learned the whereabouts of the inheritance while she was half-conscious in captivity. She was held in the MBCC, then in the Public Security Bureau of the West District. Drugging imprisoned sinners is right up the alley of those timid sheriffs. The question is, why did that particular piece of information appear in the cell? Well, the Legion had searched for it for so long, interrogated so many gangsters, and trashed so many black markets to no avail. Are you implying the Public Security Bureau is proliferating mania weapons? Don't play dumb with me. Give me the arms dealer you've been protecting. Shut it, you thug! You don't have a clue of what I'm trying to achieve here. You rotten rats! You scorn education! You have no vision! You refuse to see the bigger picture! All you do is fight each other in the mire of violence, and then rot and descend along with this stinky neighborhood. Be quiet, and accept your death. To think you even tried to lay a finger on me! I am the man who will stand on the top of the city, who will lead it to true glory! Don't make me laugh. You're a syndicate too. Thirteen years ago, you signed the West District Order Management Regulations. By betraying Syndicate to make a fortune and cultivate connections, you got yourself out of Syndicate and into the Public Security Bureau, and eventually got to where you are today. You're flaunting your new identity, and at the same time, you're eager to cut yourself off from your past. Looks like you want to be a pure dignitary. Shut it! See? You despise the violence of Syndicate, but when you come face to face with it, all you do is bluster from a safe distance. If it weren't for these filthy weapons, you wouldn't even dare breathe loudly in front of me. 
You can't wipe the slate clean, Burns. No matter how degenerate the Syndicates might become, you will be the most hideous of them all. To be honest, I did hold a glimmer of hope that there would be more of those simple-minded straight shooters, so that the stinky script wouldn't be followed again. Sure enough, there can only be one possible ending for this city in the hands of people like you. I hear people who have nothing to do with this or don't follow orders aren't allowed in. So it means these are all your people. Great. Then I won't feel bad for killing any of you. Earl did it anyway? I've told them this is my business only. Those guys, they're holding me back. I should make quick work of this, or they'll be down before I come to their aid. Now tell me about this friend of yours, Mr. Burns. Answer me! Who ordered you here? The... The, Le the Legion! It's the Legion! They asked us to charge into the square at 8.30 and make a scene to distract the sheriffs. Then Zoya could... kidnap the attendees of the negotiation. What the f This is solid evidence. Just in from the command post. Zoya broke off the negotiations with violence at 0830 and attempted to attack Mr. Burns. Alert everyone! The Legion is starting a coup! Put it down immediately! How dare you! Are you defying the order from the Public Security Bureau? Ah, this has nothing to do with the FAC. You've been assigned here by the city council. Keep to your assigned task. What do you want? I, I, I don't know anything. Okay, we'll wait for you here. What's going on here? I'm confused. Why are we here? How much longer do we have to wait? Since when did you become friends with Earl? Chief, we've got company. They've been following us. A trap? We've been tricked? Let me 
go! Let me go! I don't know anything! I'm here on their orders! <sighs> he said the Legion would be gone forever today! And the old order would return to Syndicate! <laughs> Everyone! Everyone in Syndicate wants them dead! For almost two decades, Syndicate has been held together by the rules, trade, transactions, and turf conflicts! That's the order of Syndicate. But the Legion has disrupted our order. That's why we all... Mm. We all? Speak for yourself. Now answer me. Who ordered you here? Who took the lead? Your gangs or the Public Security Bureau? Stop it! I don't know anything! I just... Ambush. You should have followed our orders, sir. Mr. Burns fully understands your position. He doesn't need a sinner lover to remain here. Hmm. Mr. Burns has said this is the punishment for your failure to do your duty. You failed to apprehend the targets you were asked to. And you failed to put the dangerous sinners under control. Your failure to play your role has put the Public Security Bureau in a tight spot. Enough said. Now shut up. Shut up for good. No one gets to harm the Chief. Or should I say, none of you useless scum gets to harm the Chief. Come on, I'll send you to meet your maker. Don't get yourself involved, Chief, or you'll get yourself in trouble in some internal blame game. You should learn to let the gangsters do the dirty work. Instead of wasting your time here, why don't you go around the area and seek out your old friends in Syndicate for a drink? They must have a lot to say to you. Next up, the Legion's gonna follow their unreliable boss and rise in rebellion. What are you gonna do, Chief? Eliminate us for the authorities, or join us in turning this place upside down? Hello, Adjutant. The Legion speaking. Tell everyone, including the Public Security Bureau, that your chief has been kidnapped again. If you don't want him to come to any harm, stop calling and butt out. Are you happy with this? Provided that your Adjutant is buying this little trick.
Adjutant Nightingale is going to worry sec. Conference Hall is under attack. I repeat, Conference Hall is under attack. Security unit S-Class alert initiated. Defend against the residual forces of the Legion. Defend the square at all costs. Repeat, defend the square at all costs. They've let several teams of gangsters get into their defense network through sewers 6 and 18. Looks like the Bureau is going to intercept us with a security unit and let the gangsters with mania weapons attack Zoya. Uh, screw it! Boss has started the fire anyway, and it's time for us to make it burn brighter! Charge at those mo- You got on quick. Now you're using me instead. I wish the commander had been more cold-hearted in using you. To either lure you to our side, or lock you up for the Legion. That way, she wouldn't have risked going deep into the lion's den by herself, betting on something that doesn't even exist. She did that all because of you. advisor and loving brother hey don't look at me like that be nicer to girls we're wasting time here time for action now the main forces of the legion are going to feign an attack from the front to stall the public security bureau and i'm going to go down to the sewer system through the secret passage in street 13 then i'll go deep into the square to find the commander Well, I'm starting to think things went smoothly in this secret passage. Looks like I was getting ahead of myself. It's the FAC! Unlike the sheriffs, the FAC focuses on defense. They don't have much of an appetite for offense. They have no desire to attack they'll definitely not let us pass there's only one way get ready to attack hold on chief is in an awkward position here chief can't just jump ship we need a strategy so we should do this strategy thing strategy that's it strategy come on come on Everybody! The Legion's attacking. Prepare to confront them. Uh, wait a second. They've taken someone hostage. Is that the new MBCC chief? Yeah. The sinners turned their chief over to me as a gift for allowing them to join the Legion. This man means a lot to you, right? I fixed a bomb in his head. If you don't want to see him dead, then get out of the way. We have no choice. We have to save the MBCC chief. <laughs> Thank you, my Legion friends. Oh, it feels so good to be free. We can eliminate them in no time. Revenge time! Charge! Let's go, Hikate! This is an order. This is an order. 
Get out of the way. Just as I expected, these monsters cannot be trusted. Shouldn't have included them in the combat troops in the first place. What do we do now? They have the chief. Our hands are tied. Should we let them pass? No. If we do let them pass, the chief will be in real danger. The other soldiers are no longer confused. Careful. That man has boosted the morale of the troops with just a few words. He's no ordinary soldier. I'll take him in. We'll get him back here and now. <laughs> 